Is it true that whatever you say to yourself becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy? If so, if you want to know, then watch this entire video now. Before I share with you how to manifest your goals into reality, I want you to share with me your goals in the comments below. Hey, what do you want? Do you want to increase your income so you make more income than you've ever made in your life? Put in a comment how much specific income you want to make. Do you want to meet your dream partner? Do you want to lose weight, improve your health? What is it specifically that you want to achieve? Put in a comment right now. Now, when we want to manifest our goals into reality, one of the most important things that you need to realize is that the universe will always respond to what you say in such way like your wish is my command. So if you say, well, I want to be successful, then the universe will say your wish is my command. And the problem is that a lot of people are very, very vague. And what I mean by that is they're not specific enough. So while we want to manifest something into reality, the first rule is rule number one. You have to be specific. It has to be measurable and it has to be attainable. Otherwise, it will not happen. It's like somebody say, I want to make more money and I give them a dollar and I say, here, you've achieved your goal. You have to be specific. Does that make sense? Now, there's another rule, rule number two, if you want to manifest your goals into reality. And the rule is basically this. A lot of people say, someday I'm going to be a millionaire. So they see themselves in the future being a millionaire. So it's kind of like pursuing something in the future. It never really comes. You see, the rule of manifesting our goals into reality is we have to see it as already achieved now, not in the future someday. My chai cup, you have to see it today, now. So the way that you imagine, you manifest your goal into reality, you say, I already have it. Okay, does that make sense? You can't see it in the future. You have to see it as already achieved. You have to see it as done. You have to hear it as done as you have to feel it as done. Yes? Now, the third rule for achieving goals is a lot of time people say, well, you know, if I say I'm a millionaire and I use that as a affirmation or incantation, I feel like I'm kind of lying to myself. And the best answer I have for that is simply this. I remember getting coaching from Jack Canfield, who's a famous teacher of the law of attraction. And he say, Michael, like he recommend to me that I call myself like the world's number one coach. And I said, you know, I'm not the world's number one coach. At least I didn't feel that way at the beginning. So Michael, it may not be a truth right now, but it's a future truth. You will grow into whatever you speak out loud. And that really resonate with me, this idea that what you say, you become. What you say manifests itself into reality. So a lot of people are afraid to say something that is magnificent, like I am a millionaire, because it may not be true right now and it sounds like a lie, but that's not how it works. It is a future truth. If you say I am a millionaire, you will eventually become a millionaire. I'll give an example of how I coach one individual who came to hire me as a coach and I do charge coaching. If you're interested in that, you can private message us. But one of the things that I taught him was this incantation that I will do whatever it takes to live my ideal life. And the way it works is we design a vision board of the dreams you have and you see them as already achieved in your head. You make a picture or on the vision board, you see an external picture of it. And you say, as you look at it, you imagine that you've already achieved it. And you say, now that I've achieved it, how do I feel? And then you feel it. What do I say to myself? You hear it. And then at the peak of the feeling, when you really feel like you've already achieved it, then you say, I will do whatever it takes to achieve my goal now. Yes. And you say that over and over again. And this is one of the most powerful incantations I learned after I hired a coach who I paid two point seven million baht. He taught me this incantation and I taught it to him. And as a result, his name was Akira. Within just two months, Akira increases income by 600%. Now the rule was that he has to do it at least 20 minutes a day to program his brain for success. And since that time, he has made as much as 5 million US per year in his businesses. So I don't want you to take lightly what I'm teaching you right now. You see, my mentor said to me, Michael, if you're not using the power of incantation, you're not using what I'm teaching you. And that made me really think, you know, am I doing it every day? Because the most important thing out of everything I've taught you is to do it consistently. Okay. You got to do it every day. Because there were a time in my life when I did it once in a while and it didn't work. It will only work if you do it every day. So I want to challenge you to do it 
consistently every single day if you want to manifest your thoughts into reality the key word the magic word here is consistency okay do you like what i share with you today then if so share with your friends your family the people you know share this video on your facebook page because when you're sharing this video you're not just sharing a video but you're teaching people proven methods to manifest their dreams and goals in reality so they'll be very grateful to you so please share this video now